Hey there, everybody, welcome back to another episode of Lobotomy Corporation. Last episode, we had a giant Aleph throwdown and we won. So, this episode is day 44. Now, from my understanding, memory repositories are every one and six. What that means is it's on every, like, for example, 21 and then 26. So we have up until we don't want to beat day 45. So after this day, we need to memory repository. Basically, after we beat 45, then we hit the next memory repository, which is day 46. So we have one more day before we need to memory repository and try to do something. So my thought process is, thought process is, is that we try to suppress Tephereth or we complete a midnight ordeal. Now, I don't know which one is going to be best. I'm thinking maybe do the Midnight Ordeal so that we can suppress Gebra and Tephereth in our memory repository. Now the thing is, is that suppressing a Midnight Ordeal, and I read up on this, can be dangerous. I believe these are going to be Aleph level. I could be wrong, but we also, when we memory repository, we don't want to do it when an employee dies because we'll lose that gear. So we want to try to do a mission where we're not going to lose everyone's gear and have to start over like we can retry the day. I mean, obviously we can retry the day on this one. It's going to, you know, throw me off a little bit, but I think probably it's going to be either safer for us to do Tephereth or the Midnight Ordeal. And I'm starting to lean towards Tephereth. I think I would like to go ahead and get this done so we're just not having to worry about it anymore. So this episode, I think that's what we're going to try to do. Now, this could be a mistake and well, it'll be too late, but by the time that we've learned that, it'll be okay, and we'll memory repository and do what we've got to do. So that's what we're going to try to do. We're going to core suppress, so it's going to kick all of our employees out, and now we've got to throw everyone into different positions here. And ideally, we want to have our strongest ones down here, so I'm going to move Hannah back up here, and we're going to probably try to move some people around. So I'm going to get this done, and uh, then we'll get the day started. Okay, I think we have our setup here. Tiu and uh, Dolce and Plague are up here, kind of helping out this team up here so that we have that and then everyone else is kind of down here they're going to help suppress i might move actually i think i might move hitch uh, up here as well um and kind of move plague maybe back down here because uh we want kind of our strong ones to be in the middle area so that they can complete uh these abnormalities pretty easily now then we have to get to clifoth meltdown level 10. meltdown level 10 is i think we had some confusion last time when i last did this but it, i i was confused and i thought it was level six I don't know why I thought it was level 6, maybe a previous thing, but we have to get to 10, which is possibly going to hit us a midnight or a dusk. If we're lucky, I, I think you guys mentioned it's probably going to be midnight, but unfortunately, the midnight completing for Tefereth does not count for Gebra, which is strange to me, but I, I trust you guys on that. So that's kind of what we're going to do. We're going to leave Hannah and Lian Schnapp out of here. I don't know if I, I probably butchered that like crazy, but that's all right. Kevin is once again going to remain by himself due to the melting love and unfortunately the new abnormality that we selected at the end of last episode will not be joining us because we are technically uh we don't have any spots open which is unfortunate because i know some of you were looking forward to that one but i will remember it and pick it for next time so without further ado let's go ahead and try to us core suppression again all right and here we are let's see here well tefra it's nice to see you again uh, in your gigantic organ self uh now then I don't remember what is the issue. I think everything breaks down at this point. I hope this performance and song will appear in their souls. So, surprise stuff for the score. Let's go ahead and get started. Now, unfortunately, and this is extremely loud, I think my game audio changed. So I'm going to just like tie that down just a little bit. There we go. All right. Save and quit. So, oh, and we have to deal with this thing again. I have to, yeah, it's just going to be a mess. But we want to get as many boxes as we can. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and send people to work on... Oh, wait. Ah, right. I was very confused. I was like, okay, hang on. Wait a minute. Why can't I see anyone from the central command team? It's fine. Don't panic. We're all right. All right. So how are we going to start this day off? Well, I need to send people to work on these things. So I'm not going to worry about training too much um, because once this is done, we're going to have to retrain some people. So I'm just going to send people who I know are going to be good at doing things. And we're just going to throw them in and try to get as many boxes as we can. So... Um, this is going to be a pretty straightforward process. Um, you guys know how this works. I'm going to skip around. I'm not going to like drag you guys through this entire thing up until something interesting happens. Um, you guys kind of know the drill here. So I'm going to get as many boxes as I can and get up to the point of where we can uh, start fighting probably some, probably some horrors, maybe like the noon and the dusk. So we'll see how far we get. 
Okay, so just kind of keep you guys updated with what's going through the facility. The music is still jamming, um, per usual. And uh, we are in Clive Health Meltdown 2. Um, I've just kind of been managing the tree down here. Uh, I've been keeping an eye on kind of keep tracking of it and making sure like I no employees going here. So that's been fine. Uh, but we are going to work our way to the Violet Dawn, which is not going to be too bad to deal with. Um, but we had our first meltdown. Not anything too bad. Uh, we just had two breakdown, which is fine. Nothing crazy at all. I think we only had two breakdown. At least I'm pretty sure. I could be completely wrong and I'm missing one. But uh, yeah, I think. Oh, nope. Oh, boy. All right. That would have been a bad one. <laughs> well, I'm glad that we caught that. So, ugh, sound orchestra about that. Uh, we need someone that's going to not die and then also kind of fail at it. Uh, do we have anyone that's like that? Yeah, anyone want to try to do that? Uh, water has okay. And we just don't want them to die. Uh, we really need someone below 50% chance that has really good um, white armor. Uh, mm, not feeling really confident about it, unfortunately. And... And the good thing is, is we know how to deal with Silent Orchestra now. It's just kind of a pain in the butt, to be honest. Uh, you have to gather everyone and make sure everyone is in the proper positions. We could send Water. Water is a okay candidate. Water doesn't have the best armor, so I think Water would honestly die. So I think what I'm going to do is I'll probably just send Danzy in there. Uh, 57. And honestly, we actually do to Pixel Gamer. Pixel Gamer has kind of a lower chance. We want that middling result. I don't think we're going to get it. I think we're going to be down one. Um, can Pixel Gamer get up here in time? Ooh, I didn't even think about that. I think Pixel Gamer should make it in time. Come on, Pixel Gamer, run. You can do it. Oh, so close. All right, there you go. Ah, we were fine. We had plenty of time. All right, so anyway, that's where we're at before I realized, hey, I was missing something. So, yeah, anyway. I don't think there's really a way to know how many's melting down. You just kind of have to keep track of it. But, yeah, we're on two now. I'm going to get to the Violet Dawn and then go from there. Okay, so we're about to hit the Violet Dawn. I kind of been taking my time. I haven't been rushing too badly, um, but I, I'm trying not to go too slow either. I'm already 20 minutes in and we're not even to Clive Off 2 yet, or 3. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start off the day by just uh, start off this meltdown by just uh, working with Tower of the Galaxy and see where these spawn. I, you guys mentioned that they only spawn, like Dawn, I think, and Dusk only spawn, or sorry, Dawn and Noon only spawn up here, um, which maybe I misread that. Okay, I don't know. I th For some reason, I read somewhere that that happened, and maybe I'm just making it up, which is very, very possible. So let's go ahead and get orders out to kill these things. Um, shouldn't be too bad. Of course, we've got two in this area, so I think we'll get Dirk Souls and Luna to take care of that one, and then the rest of these guys to go up there and ha handle that one. So there's that. Uh, Kevin has got to go deal with his own one that's way down at the end of the hall. Very convenient. Thank you, uh, Violet, Noon, or Violet Dawn. I appreciate that really do um the rest of these gonna just kind of summon the order we can see here that we have a green noon already coming up Ooh, okay that's rough um but yeah so that's what we're gonna be dealing with all right we have two that we can deal with here i'm gonna split this group have these three do this and then have these guys to you and them uh what is the other one who are you i don't know who you are uh anyway we're gonna go send this group down here and uh why not with the heck of it we'll send these guys over there too so everyone has their orders hopefully we'll take care of that relatively quickly uh, the Nuggets have their job. Um, I have been kind of executing little uh, Nuggets here and there just to go ahead and use our bullets. Um, I know you guys say, hey, you know, just just execute a couple of them so you don't have to worry about too much. Uh, why is there blood right there? That's concerning. Okay, anyway, I'm assuming that's Punishing Bird at some point. But yeah, I've been executing a couple of these little guys uh, here and there just to make sure that we don't have anything catastrophic happen. Um, so just a couple here and there. And then, uh, yeah, that's kind of the status of it. Where are y'all going? Oh, y'all, wait, no? Hello? Oh, no one actually went, it was assigned to go kill that one. Interesting. Okay, can you guys, actually, on your way up, can you just guys go kill this one real quick? Is that, is that a thing we can do? Okay, we have one panic, that's fine, I think. Let's take a look at Cloud of Monk and make sure everyone's fine. Cloud of Monk is three, Meatball's at two still, so I think we're good. Make sure no nuggets panic. Uh, speaking of nuggets, hi, guys. Uh, heard you guys wanted to, you know, be sacrificed. There you go. All right, looking good there, looking good there. Uh, you guys are handling that one. No problem. Well done. We have this one panicking. Let's just go ahead and get you out of here. See you. Um, yeah, I think we're looking pretty good across the board. We have eight of 17 bullets. Fruit of Understanding is done. We're at 764 of 1520. Got a lot to do, but I'm going to go ahead and keep doing this, and then uh, we'll get to the green noon and see what happens. 
Okay, so we're starting the green noon now. I'm gonna send someone up here to work with Child of the Galaxy. We're just gonna have Play go up here and help. Uh, green noon, I uh, have killed as many Nuggets as I could. We we're gonna try to prevent uh, anything from escaping, so I just caught a monk, uh, Big Bird, and uh, what's your name? Meatball. Yeah, good old Meatball. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and start that and see how bad this is gonna be. I don't think it should be too terrible, but we'll see. Uh, we've traditionally dealt with it okay. So, we're at Meltdown 3rd level. We've got it to get to Clyfoth Meltdown 10, I think. Uh, so, we're doing that, and we can see here that we're going to break down 10 containment units next. So, that's going to be fun. Uh, and we can see here that we have a... What is it? What do they call it again? The process of understanding. So, we have them. Let's go ahead and get this group and just absolutely annihilate them. I have no doubt that they can. Uh, same with this group. They can annihilate those. Uh, where else do we have one? Now, Kevin's got to deal with one by himself, so we're going to get this group down here to help him. Um, I, th I have no doubt that Kevin could probably tank this by himself. And you guys mentioned that Jensi can actually solo a lot, so actually, now that I think about it, we can probably send Jensi, because you guys mentioned about the Aleph uh, effects of some stats and armor. Um, I'm going to have these guys go help anyway, but I think Jensi should be fine on his own. Now then, we have two up here. Ooh, we have three up here. That's not good. Um, these guys might be okay might being a huge keyword there uh we're gonna keep our eye on them and maybe put some uh when's that thing coming through uh we might put some armor on them but we want to make sure that we prevent as many nuggets uh dying as possible so i'm gonna execute this one just so you don't die um that one's already dead so we gotta watch out for that so I'm going to have to play this extremely safe uh we do have some strong people but like these are he class um not abnormalities, but enemies, so we just have to be careful. Ooh, it's up here now, actually. Okay, let's go ahead and get you. Do an execution bullet on that guy. Uh, we could slow them down if we really wanted to. Uh, we're actually going to back these guys up. All right. Oh, wait. All right. Now we're good. Yo, you guys attack them. So that's going on. I might leave this alone. Execute you. Just got to be careful because these guys... Yeah, okay. So they're, yeah, they're doing okay damage. Um, otherwise... Our other guys have kind of annihilated them. No problem. Um, you guys are coming down here. Kevin is... I can't tell what's happening in here. I think that's Kevin. Kevin's fine. Kevin is absolutely fine. Um, so actually, just... just I was lying. You guys aren't needed. Um, how are this... How's this group doing? Man, you guys move quick, and I can't see your health, but you guys killed that one as well, so that's fine. Good. We just want to make sure no one is going to get killed here. Now, right here, that's a red bullet, if I've ever seen one. So we're going to make sure those guys don't die. How are these guys doing? Uh, okay, you can use some red shields. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, you're almost dead. So let's do a healing bullet there. And just for the heck of it, I'm going to throw a healing bullet in here, just in case. Uh, I'm going to leave this one alone at the moment. I don't think we have anyone strong enough to handle that. And actually... I'm going to get this group up here to handle this one. The rest of them should be A-OK. -okay. You guys handled that one. No one died, which is great. Uh, we do have one right here that's kind of annihilating people, but we're not going to worry about that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this squad, and you guys are going to go handle that one for me. So I think we're good right there. That one's dead. Excellent. Well done, team. Uh, that one is still alive, but I... Oh, the shield broke, so we're just going to throw another one on there for you. Okay, doing good there. Excellent. Uh, I'm going to take a look around, make sure there's no other ones kind of causing chaos. We got that one over here. And then, of course, Kevin's handling another one that's here. Interestingly. Ooh, okay. Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill. All right, Kevin, if you hand... Oh, man. Kevin does so much damage. That's awesome. I didn't even see where that one was. All right. Well, I think we're good. Um, you guys handled that one expertly. So what I'm going to do is we have this group coming up there. That's fine. Uh, we're at 1060, which is awesome. Uh, this group, absolutely annihilated. No problem whatsoever. Well done. Um, and then we have this last one, which we have a pretty advanced group coming up to take care of that. Danzy, honestly, could probably solo that by herself. She's also got the heart on. Also, I love... Oh, I thought that was like a veil or something that she had. I thought it was going to be really cool, but she has a Blue Stars gift. All right, where is this thing going? She's in the elevator with it. And just absolutely obliterating it. Um, she's taking almost zero damage. Yeah, that one's dead. All right, so we have apparently one more somewhere. I don't know where, but apparently it's somewhere. Where are you? Where are you hiding? 
What elevator are you in? Seriously, where's this thing at? Ah, okay, found it. Man, that took me a minute. It's over here. Uh, this group can go and annihilate that thing. You guys are... I'm not too worried about anyone dying here. Um, you guys are taking some damage, but you endure it. You, I mean, it's absolutely no problem. Yeah, annihilated. So, we're at 1288 of 520. 1520. Doing pretty good. So, I'm going to go back into gathering mode, and we're going to try to complete this challenge. Okay, so we've made it to level 5 now. And in my infinite wisdom, I have made the blunder of giving th Parasite Tree three bulbs on it now. So I have been down here keeping a, a strict eye on it because if it goes any further, then we're probably going to lose the game at some point. But we're, uh, I think, halfway there at this point. So hopefully we'll get this done because Tough Wrath is honestly, I think I've been dreading doing Tough Wrath, to be honest, just because of, I guess, the nature of her uh, nature of her ordeal. It's 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 a. It is a battle of attrition, and it will, it, it's kind of draining because you have to sit here for a while. And don't get me wrong, the longer, I understand that the longer the game goes on, the longer, what in the world did Mako Vader get? Oh, he got Leticia's equipment. Anyway, uh, derailed there. Um, the longer this goes on, the, I mean, well, the longer the day, the longer you're going to spend here. Like, I'm already 41 minutes in the recording, so probably going to be here another, I don't know, 40 minutes. Um, maybe in another hour or so, but that's just part of the game. Um, it's a very long game. I mean, we, gosh, we're what, 40, 41 episodes in and, uh, yeah, we, we had a great time. It's been fun. I'm looking forward to Library of Runa in all honesty. I've, I've, th I've thought about this the other night and I was like, oh man, man, it's going to be really fun jumping into Library of Runa. Um, cause I know it's a different game kind of gameplay. So it'll be, it's, it's, it'll be nice to be in this, like this, uh, lore, the Lobotomy Corp lore, but in a different game. Uh, don't get me wrong. I would love to see like a Lobotomy Corp 2 or something that like expands on this game and like does a lot of QOL in terms of commanding and stuff like that. I'd love to see new abnormalities and really, really cool. Anyway, I'm rambling again. Let's go ahead and get this um, this meltdown done. Uh, I'm just kind of sending random people here and there here and there to handle those. Uh, not too nothing too crazy. Pretty easy day. Uh, we'll get like I don't know maximum to go help with that. Uh, actually, is that the best option? Get some someone to do some repression work. That would be somewhat all right. You have some resistance to it. Sure, I've been going there. Handle that for me. Oh, someone's got to take the bite um, for Granny here. So, T, you go in there. You can handle that for me. Ooh. That one I'm going to let Matt da melt down. That doesn't, that abnormality doesn't really escape. So, I'm going to leave that one alone. And I really don't feel like kind of finicking with it. All right. So, we've got that one. We've got that one. Make sure that we've got everything across the board because most mistakes are missing something. And I'm not going to pick that one up because that one is going to kill someone. So I think we're good there. Um, we're going to have to reapply some of these because employee or agents are already in it. So we're going to have to make sure that we cover that. And I'm uh, I'm hurting that person. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to go back and apply that one. So there's two that we have to go back and redo this one and whatever that one is. So those are the ones. Punishing Bird is out of its containment unit again. Classic Punishing Bird. Uh, but yeah, so once these are done, I'm going to redo them. Oh, oh, no. Oh, Raptor. Arr. OK, we only have like we have if one more employee jumps in there, then yeah, that's not going to be all these employees down here are going to die. So I got to keep it. I see why you guys say that one was a annoying one. Ugh. Yeah, we're going to have to keep a close eye on that one. And I knowing me at this rate, we're, I'm going to forget about it again and we're going to start this day over. Oh, all right. Well. Just have to keep a super extra duper close eye on it now. Um, it broke down again, which means, golly, why is it breaking down so much? Dang, hey, no, 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 Pixel, whoa, chill. Hey, 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 chill, whoa, slow down. Hang on there, Tex. There you go, all right. All right, Pixel, you're good. All right, so let's go ahead and get this one done. I've also been sending water up here to kind of work with this one because water needs to have some increase to um, their fortitude, so water's been helping out with that one. But other than that, I think we are good across the board, except the one. So, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye on Parasite Tree like a hawk. I'm gonna watch it, you. Yeah. You know. Anyway, I'm gonna keep going. Uh, we're gonna have a 12 meltdown, which is honestly, it's not bad. There's only certain ones that we really have to be careful of in this one. Like, I can let it melt down, no problem. There's certain ones that are gonna escape, especially if we don't have the right employees to work with them. Now, this is my fault. I should have had employees prepared for this especially knowing that this was the case. So luckily, I think I put 
Where are you? I know I have you. So yeah, a how? Oh no, you're level three. And I unfortunately they all start at three. And I think this one. Yeah, produce level three or higher finished work. It lowered. So unfortunately, if that one breaks down, we're gonna have an escape. Same with Meat Lantern. Um, Meat Lantern is also that we we need someone slow to work with it, but. With all our employees starting at level three, that's not the case anymore. So we have to kind of manage that. Have someone ready to go for red. And honestly, if I know red's about to break down, you guys mentioned, hey, just throw Gen Z up there. His gear lets him do that. So we'll throw Gen Z up there and help us with that. Um, we we'll have to be careful with Big Bird and Mountain of Smiling Bodies because Big Bird breaks down when things escape, I believe. Uh, is that right? No, I think it's just when people die. Yeah. All right. So I think we're good on that. Um, so, yeah, that's kind of where we're at. Just got to keep an eye on a good old parasite tree down here. So I'm going to keep working and uh, let you guys know if uh, anything catastrophic happens. OK, guys, so we have made it to meltdown level seven. We have the amber dusk on the way. And if I remember correctly, it's the gigantic. It's kind of like the giant infestation insects that kind of come in and take out our employees. Um, so we can try and fend them off, but we need to probably kill some nuggets and I'm noticing that we only have 16 of 16 now uh, so I'm assuming we get less as time goes on but I need to, I should have been doing this a little bit beforehand so it might not go good because these guys these this it's not an abnormality but this type of ordeal they eat up employees so we're at 13 of 16 I need to have a couple if some employees die that's fine we just don't want a ton dying so you know, we're just kind of looking around, making sure everything's fine. Um, we have our meltdown, of course, going on. So, you know, there's certain abnormalities that we need to take care of. Um, nothing too crazy, nothing we can't handle. So not too worried about it. Um, the only thing is, is that we have Silent Orchestra, of course, breaking down. And we also have these two breaking down. Behavior adjustment, I'm not worried about. Alrene, I'm, I'm worried about. Uh, so we need Kevin to kind of have a middling result, I believe. So... We just do the 45% and hopefully Kevin can get it done for us. So appreciate you, Kevin. Hopefully you can do a good job. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and try to use these as much as I can. So we'll throw Sin in there for a little bit. This will, uh, golly, Dream of Black Swan. Um, we have them breaking down, which is not ideal, but I think Hostel should be able to go in there and handle that for us. Judgment Bird, we need Danzy or someone up here to go uh, handle you. Um, I just, Judgment Bird is kind of like one of those wild cards to me like I feel like an employee should be okay going to work with it but then they're not and they die and I just don't want to risk that I'm gonna send to you in there and just kind of like clean these up a little bit nothing too crazy going we'll send Hitch to help with that uh Beauty is kind of down for the count so we'll just send uh Weatherby yeah Weatherby you be good going in here yeah you got a good armor so I'll throw you in there oh and this is what I was dreading I didn't realize these two were breaking down okay actually to you cancel that uh to you you go just take the blunt of that damage all right, so we're about to have two abnormalities escape, and there's nothing we can do to really stop it. Um, that's just, uh, unfortunately, a stat check that we don't have anymore, and we don't have the luxury of getting anymore. Um, so these guys, we can send we can send someone like Mako, and hopefully Mako can get it done, but so, like, this one's going to break down regardless because this one is, uh, which one are you? Prudence? Which one's Prudence? Hang on, wait a minute. We may be able to do this. Prudence. Fortitude. No, okay, yeah. So we have a three prudence, so unfortunately that's just going to happen. Uh, this one we might be able to prevent, so I'm going to throw them in there and hopefully that'll be okay, but unfortunately Scarecrow, we just we can't prevent it. It's going to happen. We need... Uh, probably TU is going to help contain that one. Uh, TU could probably take care of it, no problem. Uh, otherwise, across the board, we're okay. We're going to have some tools melt down. Oh, yeah, Silent Orchestra. I forgot about you already. Oh, we need Danzy to handle that one, too. Um, right. Ooh, gross. Hmm. We could have Blue Fox go in there. Blue Fox does have resistance. But their sanity's kind of low. So now I'm, I'm going to have Danzy go in there here and just hopefully we can risk it. Um, unfortunately, I think Silent Orchestra is going to break out by the end of this. I don't think there's a way for us to prevent that. Um, but if we can deal with it, it shouldn't be too bad. I could do a 26%. I could do that. That wouldn't be smart because it would be a bad result, which would go down anyway. So the honestly, the probably the best option is go for the middling result. Yeah, I'm going to go for the middle. Yeah, I'm going to go for that. So we'll have that. But other than that, looking good across the board, we're going to have Ecore to go in here and go ahead and kind of shut that nonsense down. 
that's gonna break down. I'm fine with that. Uh, ooh, right. We need someone to go handle this. Um, hmm. I need hostile to handle that instead. So we'll say hostile, you go handle this one instead, and then we'll have someone else handle Dream of Black Swan. Uh, where, oh, where, and who can help us with Dream of Black Swan? We can send Mako Vader. Should be okay. Uh, do you have good? Yeah, you have good resistance. Oh wait. Oh, you still have good white resistance. I think you should be okay. We can send you to do some repression work, and you should be good. Yeah, Mako Vader should be able to handle that. No problem. All right, so that's kind of our deal going on here. We're going to have to keep an eye on Silent Orchestra and these two up here. Uh, this one is going to break out. This one may not break out. And just in case that happens... Okay, this is not great. Tu, I'm going to have up here prepared to help with this. Um, we just need to make sure the rest of these guys don't get assaulted. So once T is freed from her confines, then we'll uh, kind of send that group up there to help. Okay, how how is how is Silent Orchestra doing? We're at 11, and we need no more than 18. Which I think Danzy... Oh, 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 yeah, Danzy killed it. All right, well, okay, Silent Orchestra is going to be down a point. That's fine. We just need to make sure that Silent Orchestra does not escape along with Red... Where did okay TU's up here? TU, I need you to go help this group if you don't mind. I know TU TU has kind of stats all over the place. Alright, that one's gonna escape, right? Alright, so let's get these guys to where they're not absolutely gonna get obliterated immediately. Oh uh, yeah, so you broke out. So red is it now two. Where did this one go? We have got to stop it from killing anyone. Let's just let that thing escape for a second, and then let's play find the what 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 is that fish called? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, okay, hang on. We've got to stop Pixel Gamer. And clicking on employees is honestly kind of difficult. Like, sometimes you'll try to drag and click, like, and you click too fast to try to get them to stop, and they won't stop, and they'll keep going. I don't have a, like, a point where I can talk about that, but, yeah, you just have to trust me on that one. Uh, where did that go? Also, this one's going to break out, right? Yeah, okay, there he is. So I have to take the blunt of that damage. Oh, right there. Mako, stop. Mako, freeze. Go that way. All right, so we know that one's there. That's right outside of its containment. That's super interesting. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. All right, so we have to make sure Scarecrow's fine. Okay, TU's taking the blunt of that damage. That's fine. All right, we have a trumpet. Someone, okay, two have escaped. That's fine. Big Bird doesn't escape on the second trumpet. We already have Pixel Gamer going again into the fray. All right, so hang on. I'm trying to get rid of that. All right, who do we have escaping? Doesn't say. Where is... This is the bad thing. I, all I see is this and nothing. Oh, really? What happened? Oh, wait a bit. That one. Oh, Gen Z's. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Who, who's the target? We need to know who the target is. Gen Z should be able to solo this. Okay, hang on. We need Gen Z to go up here. Uh, Gen Z, Gen Z, Gen Z. Uh, I need you to go there now. I don't know who the target is, which is the problem. Oh, jeez. Okay, then we have this going on. It was fine until this one escaped. I didn't realize this one escaped. I guess I accidentally let it melt down, which is okay, but I really don't need this happening before. Oh, Sin. Okay, get Sin out of there. Good thing I remembered about Sin. So where is Red going? I need to know immediately who Red's about to murder. I don't... Who's Red's target? Red, who's your target? Also, the music is very, it, it's throwing me off in terms of my commentary. I don't, like, I, I don't know if I can hear myself. I don't, I, yeah, I don't know what's going on. All right, Tio's handling that. That's fine. Where's Red? Where are you going? Okay, you know what? Slow down. Uh, I would really love to play Ring Around the Rosie with the target, but I, like I said, I don't know who the target is. Is it Mako? Like, is, is your text in, in the way? Can I not see... We really need Gen C to get up there. Okay, you guys are handling that. No one up here is the target. I don't. Who's the target? Who's Red going after? Wait, what? Is, Red, what are you? What are you doing, Red? What is? What is happening? Okay, there's Gen C. Also, I gotta make sure no one transforms into this. I gotta keep an eye on you. Okay, this one isn't moving, which is good. We'll keep. We'll keep that. Al we'll keep you alone. We'll, we'll leave you alone. Ah, okay. Wait, no. Oh, perfect. Okay, this works. We'll get Jincy up here, and Postle should be able to handle that just fine. She has red endurance. Um, 
it's gonna hurt her. And I would really like look at you, look at you leap. Get him. Alright. So once Jinsey gets up here, that will be a lot better. Uh, but unfortunately, Hostel is the target, so there's not much we can do about that. And um, putting a shield on her is the only thing we can do. Uh, we can get a bunch of enemy like employees to come back here and just start wailing on red. That's probably our best option. I don't know why Hostel suddenly became the target. That's kind of interesting. I really d did something get crushed. What just happened? I think that was Meatball's effect on them. Uh, wait, I thought I put a shield on you. Did I not? Oh, there's Jinsey. Perfect. All right, Jinsey's here. Um, Jinsey's not the target though, so we'll just have to hopefully kill this thing. Uh, you are hanging out down here, which is good. Um, and you're there. Okay, excellent. Not really a great place to be. Can I just leave it out of its containment unit? Can I just leave it alone? No, I probably need to actually bring it in. Uh, yeah, Julian, go handle that for me, and don't go that way. Go, go this way. Mako, do you have? No, you don't have range. That's unfortunate. Uh, Hostel is okay. Red just does a ton of damage, in all honesty. Yeah, if I knew if I knew Red was that close, I didn't realize the 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 one we shall not look at was angry. Oh, what is going on over here? I need to get careless now. Okay, for some reason Tiu is freaking out. I don't does, is Tiu do sanity now or something? Oh, interesting. Uh, Hustle's still taking a bunch of damage, but I think she'll be fine. Yeah, y'all are, are handling red, no problem. All right, excellent. Cool. Well, that crisis was averted good. All right, so we have that going on. Um, I need you to shoot that, if you don't mind. Okay, cool. All right, everybody back to your posts. False alarm. Red was angry. All right, so now we got to deal with this guy, which is fine. We have employees that can deal with that. We just say, hey, go handle that for me, if you don't mind. Um, I'm going to use... But yeah, we already commanded these guys to go attack. If we don't look at it, it won't do anything to our employees. Simple as that. Also needs to go back and get healed. Of course, Punishing Bird's doing Punishing Bird things. Excellent. All right, now we can work towards Amber Dust. So I'm going to work towards that. And then hopefully, hopefully it'll go well. Hopefully. Anyway, back to it. All right, guys. I'm not going to lie. I'm nervous about this one. So we're at the Amber Dust now. I'm going to send Plague up here to start it off. And actually, I'm, act I'm actually not going to send Plague. I'm going to have Plague ready to go. Uh, we're going to send a uh, peaceful buffalo up here. I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of nervous about this one. I've kind of stationed Aleph level employees all over the place, um, along with some Wav level Abner, uh, not Abner employees everywhere. Um, so just so I can get Aleph geared employees kind of around hostels up here, Raptors up here, um, just so we can kind of, I don't know if spreading runs are damage is best, um, but I have some bullets saved up just in case we need to. There probably will be some nuggets die, but ideally we want to avoid anyone dying i okay here we go we're already starting all right so we have them everywhere okay well then let's go ahead and get started uh we'll have that group take care of that uh ugh, ugh. all right um right that is not as oh boy i'm hoping these things are weak are these things weak they're 550 I'm gonna send Kevin to deal with that one, but ooh, not liking the way this is so far. We needed to deal with the ones that are kind of near Nuggets, so let's go ahead and get. Yeah, I'm, ooh, I'm, I don't, I don't know about this, guys. Um, huh. All right, well, let's just let's just try to deal with this as the best we can. Um, I'm actually just gonna send Raptor to handle one by themselves. Uh, the rest of these guys, I don't know about. Oh, they're going anyway. Okay, that's fine. Um, we're gonna kind of. Do a look-see down here and see how good this goes. I mean, God, Lee Jensi's really strong, and Jensi's having trouble with that one. Right. Uh, Danzy. Where's Danzy? Uh, Danzy's over here. Danzy is absolutely obliterating that one. We'll get this group to head over here and help her out, except Dirk Souls. Um, Dirk Souls, unfortunately, has a low sp uh, stat spread. So I would like to grab... You know what? We're just going to grab this one and then go over here. I'll say disciplinary team. Everyone but Dirk Souls go in there and help. Um, Kevin should be able to handle that by himself. We'll leave that one alone. Uh, we do have, we're going to, Ooh, we actually, okay. Because we, Oh, we already have the, the Amber Midnight. Okay. I'm going to have to refer to my notes to you from you guys about that one. All right. So, uh, pixel gamer, uh, go help with that one. And Danzy's helping with that one. There's this one over here. We're going to have to use our bullets to kind of execute employees. I forgot. Like once you hit that, the employees restart. So I'm kind of looking anywhere where there's going to be nuggets available for uh food we want to avoid that as much so pickles gamer is going to go in there and handle that 
Uh, these guys should almost be done with there, so we can actually move them up to the next one. So they'll handle that for us. This group we're eventually going to send up to handle this. Oh, yeah, we need... Okay, Peaceful Buffalo might get murdered. Um, That's okay, I think, maybe. I don't know, we'll see. Okay, but handle that one. Kevin is doing Kevin things and damaging. Good, good. Um, Okay, this one's dead. Good. You guys, uh, to the next one. Go up there. All right. So this is going to be kind of a slow, arduous process. Um, we'll let Raptor take that, I th hope. Maybe. Unless... Oh, yep. Okay, those guys just straight up died. Uh, right. What do these things do? I can't necessarily see what they do. Uh, can I click on one? Is there one I can just observe they do red damage so anyone that's in here hey here have a red shield i have no idea who's in that dog pile uh how are we doing down here is everyone alive everyone honky dory uh that one's kind of moving i think we're okay we had one person die that's fine we're okay me is meatball getting a running start Ugh. okay meatball's getting a running start we need to be careful of that um we need to any anything that's ready to break out we need to okay cloud of monk is there oh big birds at three okay yeah this one i don't this one is this one's tough for me i i have realized mac okay mac we need to get these guys out of here raptor actually took a ton of damage there which is interesting okay maximum and you go that way raptor should live i don't i don't know why raptor's having so much trouble there okay pick oh it dug okay uh where are we at now danzy is mia which is fine we'll get her up here uh so danzy you go up and get that for me this group is handling that. Peaceful is still working on that. That's fine. Uh, I don't know where that gang is going. Uh, we just need to make sure Meatball doesn't escape, because if we have multiple abnormalities escape, it's going to be tough. Uh, Kevin is okay at the moment. We might have these guys go back him up. Oh, we have another one in here. Oh, and there's a, okay, there's a pawn. Kill them. Okay. Raptor is... Somewhat handling this one. I'm gonna heal Raptor. Just put one on you. Okay. Murdered that one. Okay, so that's good. Um Where's okay, Danzy's handling that one. Going to that one. This group. Okay, plague is low, but we'll get plague some health. That's good. Alright, good, good, good. Oh, alright. Uh Kinsley Cappuccino died. Oh no, Cappuccino, and something has escaped. Alright. What has escaped? We need to know. Uh we have multiples up here. Okay. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. We've got to play it super safe. All right. So there's that. Raptors handled that for us. Everyone in this department, go back. Um, these guys are going to go up here and handle that. That's fine. They're a pretty strong task force. I was actually, you know what? We're just gonna, We'll get Pixel Gamer. Send these guys down here. We'll get Raptor to go with Pixel Gamer and handle that issue. Um... That one's kind of glitching out. That's fine. I'm I'm okay with that. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. So this group has handled that one. They're probably on their way back down, which we don't need you guys doing. We actually need you guys to go help with the situation up here. Um yeah, let's get It's really difficult to manage all this. I'm not gonna lie. Gen C, E cord. We'll leave water alone. Water's almost dead. Pixel Gamer is struggling. Where's Hostel at? How are we doing? I need to know where everyone's at, and I've kind of lost track, unfortunately. Hostel's up here with this group. Okay, that's fine. We got all this down here. This group is fine. Kevin is slowly dealing. It's not as fast as I would like, so I might get these guys to go help Kevin. Kevin will get that done. I'm not worried about that, actually. We'll, we'll, this up here is a whole mess and a half. Do we have any Aleph employees not doing anything up here? Uh, we have Hitch, but Hitch is not leveled up at all. Ugh. Yeah, we're not looking pretty up here. Um, we have this group. We have Plague and Luna and all them. We might get them to go help. I don't know where Danzy went to. She's Oh, she's just kind of being the Grim Reaper. Excellent. Um, Danzy's extremely <laughs> strong. Um, so we're going to... Oh, she's actually got a suppression order already. So a lot of these have moved up, which is fine. We just don't need anything escaping anymore. Uh, how is Meatball doing? Meatball's okay, we just don't need anyone to die, so let's just kind of unpause for a second. Alright, Hostel's in here, which is good. Um, we've got three Aleph's and two in here. Um, can you guys actually... Pixel, can you handle those? And you guys kill this, if possible, maybe. 
Yeah, they've got that handled. What is going on in here with Danzy? Danzy's doing that. And she's a really... Oh, yeah. Dan, I forgot Danzy's extremely powerful due to her um, item that she has on her. We have this one over here. Okay. That one is moved, so now all these guys are having to move again. Oh, these are annoying, aren't they? I could try to send this group up here to finish that off, but I don't think I am. That one has dug again. Danzy's on her way. It's in here now, I think. Actually, I don't even know where Danzy is. I think she's just... Oh, nope. What is, what is happening? Where is... Is she fine? Okay, how, how is everyone's health looking? I don't even know how everyone's health is anymore. We have a lot of the small ones now, and it's kind of not a good situation. We can go up here and send these guys to kind of help cull the small ones, I guess. Oh, this situation is not great. Danzy is taking, ooh, taking a lot of damage there. Okay, she's good. I'm going to heal Danzy real quick. We need this group to handle that. Is there anyone... Kevin's okay down here. Okay, good. All right. How, who's, who's over here? That's Peaceful Buffalo. That's fine. You stay there, Peaceful. You stay there and be peaceful. We had one dig. Jinsey's up here. Probably going to annihilate that one for us. Okay, great. Um, You guys go help me with this one. I, if we have the Amber... If this is the Amber... Dusk... And we have the Ember Midnight next. I'm, I'm so done. If it spawns these, I'm, I'm so done. Oh no. Okay. So we have Jinsi gonna go up here, help suppress that. Ecor to go help with that as well. Ecor's got range. Um, we'll send Blue Fox and, yep. Okay, that's good. All right, how are we doing over here? What is, what is the situation? Is this one dead? Y'all killed it. Okay, good. I think maybe. All right, what do we got now? Oh, geez. All right, let's get Hostile Buffalo and all of them over here. Uh, when did we lose Kinsley? Oh, yeah, that's right. Kinsley is like one of the first ones to die. Let's get Hostile over here. And then we have Mako Vader. I, I really need to use these guys. Yeah, let's bring these guys up for backup. Um, except Dark Souls. We won't get Dark Souls for backup. Um, Kevin is still dealing with that. That's fine. Raptor and all of them. Let's get Raptor back on duty. Yep, that sounds good to me. All right, cool. So who is over here dealing with this? Who is who is this? Who is, oh, that's Ecord managing by himself. Okay. Um, Hopefully we've got plenty of people going over here. What is, where are y'all going? What is... All right, I guess you guys are going down there. Um, Ecord is handling this by himself, which he shouldn't be. These guys go up here with the the uh, the two Aleps, and we'll leave these guys alone. I think we're still good on that oh but these guys are gonna escape i might force them to escape if i can so i don't have to deal with them on the amber midnight granted if there's no nuggets to kill then i guess we don't have to worry about that but oh that one's gone again oh gosh all right kevin handled this which is good we can probably get kevin up here to hit help um so we might get that going yeah where's danzy going hey, danzy go help with this one actually just since you're down here um and all of you Gosh, yeah, this is a lot to manage, isn't it? Huh, okay. Um, All of you go in here and help with that. We really have a ton to deal with, don't we? That one burrowed. Okay, awesome. That one also burrowed. It was just, okay, now we're playing chase the enemy across the facility. I could get more of these guys, but I'm afraid, like, if we lose any more employees, it's just gonna, it's gonna result in a very, very bad thing. Get Danzy to kind of clean these up, because she can one-shot these, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Kevin helped Danzy out with those, actually. You guys go handle that. That's fine. Uh, how are we doing over here? Ecord's taking a... Oh, gosh. Ecord to you. No, get out of there. Uh, do we have... Ooh. Ooh, 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 to you. Here, have some health. Um, do we have any Aleph's in here at all? Hang on. We need we need Aleph's to help with this situation. Uh, where are our Aleph's? Oh, they're up here. That's right. Granted, they're doing a ton of damage, but still... Okay, there's that at least. Oh man, so much to manage. Dandy's murdering, which is great. So we have three left, four left. We have an item and I'm out. Um, I could, can I heal all of you? Okay, heal all of you, send you in there, then put a red shield on. Or do that, that works too. Just absolutely obliterate my employees, that's fine. I was okay with that. Um, They moved again. Oh, oh and of course they're down here where Kevin is no longer at. Uh, but Kevin and <sighs> okay. Well, I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm I'm not gonna make you watch the uh, the long version of this.
Good news is we beat it. Oh man, that was that was torture. So yeah, that's where we're at now. We lost a couple employees. We lost two employees. We have meatball wound wound up and ready to go. Unfortunately, I'm gonna send everyone back to where they need to be, and, and then we have the Amber Midnight next, which is not looking forward to that one. Which is it's kind of it's kind of wild to me that you can't complete objectives for other Sapphira on those days. But I guess at the same time it does make sense, um, because it's technically not a day. I don't actually. I don't. Is it a day? Does it take a day? I don't know. Oh, good. Plague's under control again. Oh, love Parasite Tree. Where are you at, Plague? I don't need you doing what you're about to do. Where's Plague? It should be... Plague should be very shiny. Where's Plague? Oh, Plague? Oh, no. Hey, there, Plague. You came out of nowhere. Come, stop it. And there we go. All right, Plague's handled. So I'm going to get ready to do the Amber Midnight, and uh, we're going to try to get these abnormalities ready to go. I have a feeling there's going to be a good chunk that are going to try to escape, and I'm hoping not. Now we need to prevent as many deaths as possible. So uh, I'm going to actually take out some nuggets while we're at it. Uh, we're not going to have any left in the facility, most likely, um, just so we don't have the risk of Meatball escaping or Big Bird and causing Apocalypse Bird to show its ugly head. So that's what we're going to do, and uh, I'll get caught up with you guys. All right, guys, here we are, the Amber Midnight. And luckily, you guys have given me some tips on this. I don't know what it's going to look like, but you guys say, hey, use your lifts. I was like, OK. You said use lifts, kill until dead. So that's what I'm going to do. I appreciate the advice as always, but let's go ahead and see what happens here. This is our first midnight. And some, I, I'll preface that I did say at the beginning of the series, like, you know, I appreciate tips and tricks and all that. And the more I kind of get into the series, the more I'm grateful that you like, you know, I, sometimes I didn't like backseating for this per se, but you know, having this game and how long it is and how difficult it is, it is nice to kind of know this in all honesty. Um, cause you can spend, like, I'm spending an hour. Okay, the internal meal. I'm spending an hour and a half, almost two hours on this, and that's a lot of progress to lose. I get the difficulty is, is the draw of the game. Um, but, okay, so we have a lift down here, and then we've got, we have, it looks like, another a lift down here. So there's two of them. And now we have bullets. I'm gonna kill this guy before he dies. So let's go ahead and do that. We don't want anything else happening there. I don't know where our other nugget is. Oh, there it is. And that should be the remaining nugget in the facility. So... We need to beat this, and uh, I'm going to let it play out and then pause. Get that out of there. All right, so we have this guy appearing, and we have this guy appearing. Kevin's by himself, so I'm going to send this group down here. So I'm assuming the way the mechanic works is that these are going to appear, and you have, like, okay, so it eats. When can I send them in? Can I send them in now? Is that a, I'm going to find out the hard way, all right? And I did, if we have to go back to the more peaceful day, I did do this. So if we learn the mechanic and I learned it wrong, I will find someone to sacrifice. I don't know who's going to be our sacrifice. It has to be a level five, but we will use the sacrifice just if I miss something up here. So I guess we'll use this first. I know it's not going to be a ton of employees, but we're going to see what happens. I'm hoping that's not like a burning field that's going to kill people. But um, yeah, looks like everyone's OK. Ooh, y'all are taking sanity damage. OK, so we need to keep an eye on that. But so far, so good. Um, we don't have... Yeah, you're taking a little bit of sanity damage, but that's okay. I don't know if there's any attacks that go off or not. Not sure if that's just, like, the one attack it does. Um, wow, that is a tanky, tanky thing. It's endured to, what, everything? Let me guess. Yeah. Wow. Okay, that's fair. Um, sure. Alright, so someone took some damage there, interestingly enough. Oh. Uh, that doesn't sound back up i don't know what that means i don't know what it is i'm gonna say everyone get out i don't don't know what it's doing i'm learning here um so back up oh 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 no oh that's not good oh that's real bad do i just want to use the rabbits we still have to do this oh but it's gonna escape the rabbits won't be able to kill it no, I could use red. But red's only going to kill one of them, right? So I can request it to hunt... That's Tev. What? Hang on, wait a minute. That doesn't seem right. Will you hunt Aleph? I don't think it'll hunt Aleph, will you? Oh, no, you will hunt Aleph. Yeah, let's send red after one of these. I'm going to do that just so we have some backup. Oh, but man, having these spawn... We, we struggled already with these. Now, what I'm wondering, do these ever move?
I really don't like we're having to deal with these. If I'm honest. Ugh. I knew it was going to spawn more. That's how it always works. Okay, Red's going to go down here and kind of work on that. I'm going to send Aleph's team up here. And I don't know if I should have them moving through things. I don't know if these move. I don't think they do. I mean, these obviously move and they don't. Okay, they're digging. They're digging. Ugh. Okay. Red's going down. Okay, they do move. Okay. Um, right. Where are we going? Where are we heading? That one is doing something. Okay, that one's going. That this is gonna be. This is gonna be a lot, isn't it? I can already tell this is gonna be a lot. So we're gonna move up here. We're gonna move these around here, and we're gonna immediately go attack. Where's our other one? God, these are everywhere. Look at them. It's just just a giant infestation. I could use the rabbits to like kill an entire area, but the the fact that they didn't go to one of our Alif groups is kind of tough. And I gotta figure out where Red's going. Did, Wait, do they go to the same one? Are they both in here? Where'd the other one go? No, it's in this central area. So red is going. We're oh geez, red. Okay. Um No one getting red's way, just let him do his thing. Yep, red's gonna go that way. Uh you guys just kinda hang out, I guess. Don't get in red's way. Maybe go kill this stuff up here. Um, because we need to manage that. Ugh, this group this group has to go here. We've got to take these out as quickly as possible. I'm really nervous about getting anyone else in these rooms. So I'm going to I'm going to work on this. This is this is definitely going to take me some time. You guys kind of get the general loop, but I'll definitely definitely bring you in if anything really, really bad happens. OK, so we're kind of handling this one in the middle here, um, doing a lot of damage to it. Uh, this group over here is kind of starting cleanup duty on at least eliminating these guys. Oh, Dark Souls died. Yeah, I should have known that. Okay, is that mean Meatball's escaping? Hang on. Okay, this one's down here. I don't think Meatball's going to escape because of that. Oh, this was this was looking... So we're going to have to do, like, cleanup and then mass kill, um, it looks like. I'm going to, like, heal people. I don't know what's going on. I don't know who's alive or what's happening, but I'm... Sin is dead. Luna's dead. Who not? Where? Were they right here? I didn't even see them. Oh, no. All right, that's not good. We lost Luna and Sin in this. I'm assuming they were part of this group. Yeah, I'm assuming they were part of that group. Now, Red is still kind of assisting us with that one. That's fine. Uh, these guys, they can go down here. We don't need to lose any more employees. If we lose any more employees, that's kind of it, unfortunately. Uh, we're going to we're gonna really regret that. Ah, oh, that one moved. Dang, okay. We're going to keep this group here for right. The problem is, is I'm not focusing on cleanup duty at all, and I would say the game wouldn't be mean and keep spawning them, but this is Lobotomy Corporation. I would believe that they... Did Hostel die? Wait, where'd Hostel go? Oh, <gasps> no! Oh, no. I should have been paying attention. This is, this is tough. This is real tough. Especially since it keeps spawning these things for you. Yeah, this is rough. Okay, well, I'm going to do my best, but I don't think I'm going to be able to complete it, unfortunately. I, I don't know how we're going to complete this, in all honesty. This is a this is a really tough one to deal with, especially with the amount of enemies that it's spawning for us. That's, that's kind of wild. So I guess we're going to go in here, try to eliminate as much as we can. Um... I mean, they can annihilate as long as they're kind of grouped up together, but otherwise it's 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 not looking pretty. OK, so the strategy I'm going with here is I'm just keeping everyone together because uh, Pixel has the healing. And so far we have red kind of going around the facility and I can clean up. We don't have to worry about any nuggets dying. And so I'm just kind of keeping everyone in the same area and we can clean up with this group. And then Raptor can kind of passively heal people as we move on to like different areas of the facility where these things are moving. Um, that's kind of how I'm handling this. It's not the most. As long as as long as our other employees are in the elevators, they're going to be fine. We're just going to have a very long cleanup phase, which is unfortunate. But it's going to be what I'm, I'm going to go with. Um, I think it's just going to be the best option, in all honesty. Uh, so like while they're not going to be able to hunt down these things. 
100%, at least we'll be able to slowly kill them. Um, it's gonna be like just, it's gonna be a, uh, a, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I said, I think I said it earlier in this episode, but, um, just attrition. Oh, oh, hey, Red. Um, sorry, we didn't mean to take a prey. Coming back. So Red's gonna handle that for us. Uh, we can go on cleanup duty. I think, maybe. Uh, I don't even know where the other one's at. Oh, it's way down there. Okay, well. We we've done a lot of damage. It's just we're gonna have to slowly do this. It's it's gonna it's gonna be slow and arduous. It's a battle of attrition. That's that's basically it. So I'm gonna that's the process I'm gonna go with. Everyone's gonna stay together, uh, heal off each other, and go for that. I should have done that with. Oh, water died. I did water die. No. Well, I mean we have the memory. Pro no, wait. I don't think employees go back with a memory repository, do they? I don't know how that works. I mean, I know that we lost a good bit of gear, so we're gonna want that gear back. I don't know we will get those employees back. So if we do lose some employees, it's okay. We're gonna memory repository and it should be fine. I'm pretty sure that's how that work. It works. If it doesn't, we lost a lot of good employees. Um, so that's kind of the process we're gonna go with. Um, we're too far. I, you know, I would back it up, but I think we'll be okay. Ooh, we don't have enough to get that one. That's fine. Um, I don't. Where's Kevin? I don't even think Kevin's with us. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's gross. We can use the rabbits, but I don't think we have to, especially with the method I'm doing here. Um, is Kevin with us? Uh, Vincent is low on health. That's fine. We don't need anyone else dying. I'm going to heal you. I'd have, honestly, I don't know where Kevin's at. I think Kevin's alive. Kevin, are you alive? Oh, uh, all that, all that red dead extraction team. Where's Kevin? Kevin, is he in there? Oh, nope. Yep, he was in there. All right. Hey, Kevin, don't go in there with Red. Yeah, come out of there with him. All right. So that's where we're at now. We need to see where one is moving. Um, we know that one moved down here. Um, it's probably going to move again and spawn more lovely, lovely enemies. Um, Red's going to be chasing one across the facility for all eternity, probably. But hey, that's what we paid Red to do. Uh, let's go down to this elevator here and maybe clean up some of these excess things while we got, are at it. Maybe one will spawn. Oh, OK. We have one over there. Not the best place and I think that's the one red was dealing with maybe I don't know which one red actually no I think red was dealing with the one that we just did a ton of damage to so let's go ahead and get everyone in here and then let's get kind of clean up some of these excess um yeah excess play I don't know what to even call them insects out of here um and then we'll go over here and then we'll get this group kind of just they're not strong but hey they're a group and we might as well use them um <laughs> with the sparkle okay love it uh, Mako's terrified. I'm gonna let them do a little bit of damage and then get them out. Just say, hey, good job. Well done. Um, the sparkle was actually, I think, from Kachala Galaxy's attack, which is pretty funny. All right, so this one's already moving. That's wonderful. Glad that you stuck around to hang out with my group of... Oh, okay, never mind. You know what? I'm... Delaney is dead. Oh, jeez. Please don't. Please don't spawn. I don't even know where Delaney was. What was the wait? What, what was Delaney in here? Did she get eaten? We've lost so many people. Okay, everyone's in an elevator, right? I did I miss someone somewhere? Did I? I all right, well I'm gonna keep doing this and hopefully no one else dies. All right, guys. Good news is I think we finally killed our first one. Red has done their job, and that is down. Thank you, Red, for your service. We greatly appreciate it. So now we got to deal with this last one that's running amok. And luckily, I think it has stopped spawning smaller enemies, which is great. Love that for us. Now, we need to figure out where this one's going to go next. Um, I'm going to kind of sit in the middle of the facility here and wait for that to happen. And if we have any of the other ones that we need to clean up, then we will. But at the moment, we're just going to try to follow that around and see what, what we can do. Okay, guys, we have done it. The Aleps are dead. Now it is time for cleanup duty. So now we just got to go to the facility and clean this up. Not gonna lie, that was difficult. Once we figured it out, once we figured it out, it's not bad. It's just the fact that it takes a while. You have to be patient. It's a battle of attrition. You kind of gotta just let it do its thing. So yeah, that's where we're at. We're sending everyone to clean up duty, and I'm not. I'm not sending anyone by themselves. Um, everyone's kind of gonna stay as a group. We're gonna kind of pick these off as they move near us. And uh, yeah, that's kind of the plan I'm gonna go with. Uh, unfortunately, they kind of move all over the place and they're going to be here, there and everywhere. Um, so we're just going to kind of clean that up real quick and then I'll uh, cut back. And then we have two more meltdowns to worry about. All right. I've enabled the rabbit protocol and I know it's going to take a lot of our um, 
take a lot of our boxes away, but we're going to get a good chunk for completing this objective. I just sent the rabbits here. Uh, Meatball escaped. Unfortunately, we lost Monko Vader, Gabriella, uh, Mabel, and some other ones. I don't know how they died. I don't know where they died at. I think they were like part of our major group up here, and somehow they got absolutely ganked by a ton of these guys up here. So yeah, I just went in and called the rabbits. Um, that, I think that's a good time to do that. We had a story event with the rabbits the last time, too. So we're just going to let them handle that. And uh, yeah, take that, Meatball, you jerk. So anyway, yeah, we're at 1380 now um, of 1520. Wait, what is going on down here? Miss Waffle, why are you panicking? What? how did you... Okay, we need someone to save this man. Um, Blue Fox, you have the ability to shoot him, so I don't know. Use I, <laughs> Blue Fox basically has a tranquilizer if I... If that. Yeah, anyway, uh, we're going to do that. Uh, we're going to kind of restock here and figure out who we lost granted if we're doing a memory repo it's not going to matter um but we lo we lost a lot of people we lost a lot of people so we're going to get blue fox to kind of tranquilize Pe peaceful buffalo blue fox thank you for your service um but a lot of you who passed away will luckily be back wow look at look at that 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 could have been prevented by me that's crazy i could have prevented that so but we learned how to you know handle it now um, so we're just going to get these boxes and hopefully smooth sailing. We do have some meltdowns we have to deal with. Uh, Cloud and Monk could possibly escape. Ideally, we want to prevent any other escapes from happening. So that's what we're going to do. I think peace, hopefully Blue Fox has hunted down Peaceful Buffalo at this point. I think she has. Yeah. So that's good. So I'm going to go ahead and proceed through the day as normal. And hopefully, hopefully we don't have to worry about any, anything else. Okay, guys, we're about to complete Meltdown 9 with 20 two breaking down um we're gonna cause parasite tree to uh, to break down not break down but like at least cause this meltdown and what i'm hoping and i <laughs> i'm secretly hoping that this is um you know when we reach meltdown 10 and not complete meltdown 10 i could be wishful thinking which is you know it, it's all i can ask for at this point um but i would love to get tethras done because i'll be honest this this suppression has been extremely stressful with how long it's gone on i think this is probably the oh there it is. Oh, my hopes were answered. Okay, man, this was a long play session. Got a C. Survival rate, 61%. 12 dead. 12. 12 dead. That's that's so bad. I feel terrible, but we're going to proceed to the next day. And uh, let's see what story we've got ahead of us. All right, I got some music playing. And we have Lisa and Enoch. So, Enoch. Have you ever heard of the nest? I hear they throw a festival every single day there. I want to dance, Enoch. I want to stomp my feet and let happiness take over my body. Lisa, if you take a bit of time to look around here, it's quite nice too. But we aren't allowed to go anywhere. Carmen just wants us to keep confined here, keep us confined here. She's a good person. I hope you'll open up to her soon. I don't want to get to know anyone else. All I want to do is be with you. I can't promise to be next to you forever. There's a lot of things that have been mulling over for quite some time, and I thought I might, may find some answers for them here. Some of my thoughts may be so absurd that the answers to them might not exist at all. Or even if the answers do exist, they may, might vanish too soon. But in the process of searching for those answers, I will be able to cast off my shell. Then I can fly away, at least, leaving my heavy body behind. Sometimes I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't know where you want to go, but I promise that you'll take me with you, Enoch. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, A is here, so I guess we gotta go now. It's gonna get dark, uh, cold and dark soon. Yeah, soon. Soon cold days will come. <laughs> what, are they like talking about like being a robot or something? Hey, even though I had to thought, uh, I never thought of them as family or someone that needed to care for, I made it my job to bring the children back home to ease Carmen's busy schedule. I see them. Those young kids running towards me. Those children who survived the outskirts. The two we saved. Tefereth, I thought you could do I could do that all my own all my own. I wanted to show Tefereth how mature I became when I got he got back uh, one day. But there was no end to the disappointment, and Tefereth never got any better. I couldn't stand the silence without an answer. So I thought. I thought that I'd rather that I'd rather hide my disgusting guilt. I was so used to it as feelings never existed in the first place. But whenever I see Tefereth's empty smile, my heart feels as if it were being covered in dark ash while shattered into millions of pieces. I knew Tefereth could never go back to how he used to be. I was aware that I could never return to the happy days we spent together. 
but I was about to abandon Tefereth just because it was too hard for me to endure. All while knowing that he was the one who suffered the most. Tefereth, are you done with all your busy work? Dot dot dot. We're going to be late. Let's get going. The sun will set soon. Please hurry, Lisa. Right, my name was Lisa once. Tefereth doesn't remember my name anymore, but from the time to time he calls me by my cast-off name. What did Tefereth want out of all this, even after sacrificing himself? What was he waiting for, even when he... Oh, he was being discarded. Was it all worth it to him? I don't know. I've never ever held any expectations in my life. And there's Tefereth, but I'll try counting on you now. I want to believe that there is a reason for every sacrifice that was made, and to know eventually everything will be okay. And there it is, 50% germination of the Seed of Light. We have 50% uh, 50 more to go. The expectation for the meaning of existence. Angela, I had wanted to free myself from the pain, but I realized it was impossible. It was only recently that I found my answer. It is that I have to accept the pain as something I have born from, begin from the beginning. Then I can be set free. Manager, if you are suffering too, just take in the pain and accept it. We don't. You don't have to keep changing things if it's too hard for you. I know you want to keep pressing on in any way possible. You felt lost and scared of the present, so all you could do was blindly trace along uh, the way through the dark. I admire such determination at first, but now you look so pathetic. How long do you think you can keep this up? Will you ever make it to the end? The time is upon you. It is time to complete the final piece of the puzzle you've been missing. May you have the best of luck on the last leg of your journey. Saying something like, I hope you will finally be happy, or that some of the leftover pain can be relieved now, have long become empty words. There are several more things I'd like to say, but let me sum them up for you in one sentence. I wish for you to succeed. I think that's what she said. I could I accidentally misclicked. I enjoy being with you not only for these these 45 days, but also the moments you just you don't remember. Well, there is just one last sapphire you need to meet. Dot dot dot. He holds his hands a warm Warmth that looks so comforting, but he can shatter people's hearts like they are nothing. Locked architecture team. Okay. So we have one more to meet, huh? And I think we completed Hawkman's mission too. I could be wrong. I'm hoping we did. I didn't even check. I'm pretty sure we had every abnormality looked at. Yeah, here we... Wait, never, never mind. Okay. The base number of managerial bullets increased by 30%, and the pale shield bullet unlocked. The department in which the suppression took place will no longer be influenced by meltdowns, which is awesome. We don't have to worry about Silent Orchestra anymore. Oh, that's so good. Granted, if we're going to restart at some point, then, you know, it is what it is. But um, yeah, so we completed that objective. We're done there. Um, we It is time for us to do a memory repository. We ideally want to do um Gebra's ordeal um so next episode we'll be doing the memory repo and then moving on from there um I am going to try to get any gear that we may have missed um so I'll do that next episode but that is where we're at guys I appreciate all your tips and tricks that you provided in this series uh so far it really has helped we did a mi major milestone in two episodes in a row really so there is that let me know what you think down below and how it went and uh, any other feedback that you may have but that's going to be it. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day wherever you may be. As always, thank you for spending some of your time here. I'll see you for the next one. Bye, everybody.